ground control. Roger, Challenger. The exploration of space will go ahead, whether we join in it or not. And it is one of the great adventures of all time. And no nation which expects to be the leader of other nations can expect to stay behind in this race for space. Those who came before us made certain that this country rode the first waves of the Industrial Revolution, the first waves of modern invention, and the first wave of nuclear power. And this generation does not intend to founder in the backwash of the coming age of space. We mean to be a part of it. We mean to lead it. Keep an eye on weather around the pack. Here's our first live look inside the suit up room. Wow, it is, it is so exciting to see this, isn't it? All four of them. <laughs> yeah, it's just, okay, so there's a look at uh, Commander, that looks like Mike, Mike Hopkins. Yeah. So Kate, walk us through um, what are they doing in these seats? And obviously they're, they're getting some checkouts, making sure the fit is good. Uh, walk us through what is happening, the mechanics of what's going on in the room. This is shuttle uh, launch control at T minus two minutes, 28, I mean two hours, 28 minutes and counting. Here comes the 51 uh, l flight crew boarding the elevator uh, for the second time in two days, ready to depart the ONC building for the launch pad. And they'll ride down the uh, three floors to the main level where they will uh, exit the ONC building, traditionally met by the members of the media who are uh, standing by waiting to uh, document. And this is the work crew here that uh, has been uh, very active in uh, preparing the 51L mission at the operations and checkout building. Flight controllers here looking very carefully at the situation. Obviously a major malfunction. We have no downlink. We have a report from the flight dynamics officer that the vehicle has exploded. Flight director confirms that. We are uh, looking at uh, checking with the recovery forces to see uh, what can be done at this point. We have vowed that we shall not see space filled with weapons of mass destruction, but with instruments of knowledge and understanding. Yet the vows of this nation can only be fulfilled if we in this nation are first, and therefore we intend to be first. We will report uh, more as we have information available. Again, to repeat, uh, we have a report uh, relayed to, through the flight dynamics officer that the vehicle has exploded. We are now looking at uh, all the contingency operations and awaiting uh, word from any recovery uh, forces in the downrange field. But why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why 35 years ago fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and Reports measure the, the best of our energies and vehicle, skills. Uh, because uh, that challenge is one that we're willing uh, to accept, uh, in the water, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win on the other side. from uh, uh, as to the location of the recovery forces in the field to, to see what uh, may be possible at this point. 10, 9, 8, eight 7, seven six. 6, we have main five, engine start, 4, four, four three, 3, 2, two 1, zero. and liftoff.
liftoff of the 25th Space Shuttle mission and has cleared the tower. Good roll program confirmed. Challenger now heading down range. Engines beginning throttling down now.